Okay. <clears throat> Automotive blocks. Uh, C9R, I think this model is called. I have a couple of these. So let's model it. So on the right plane, I've already selected that right plane and made a new sketch. And uh, I measured this uh, body out at um, one and a half height and length, I think, I yeah, seven. Uh, so if I hit edit sketch, that's what I did. I put a seven inch rectangle with a one and a half inch height. And then um, I extruded that um, here. And um, the yeah, 3.25 inches is the depth of that width of that car body. Let's see, I think uh, here it is. I'm basing this off the picture I got from Amazon here, and I've downloaded that for you guys. And then uh, I put some fillets here uh, on the edges. Um, so let me undo that. So this fillet here, if I edit that, what was that size? 1.207, I guess 1.2 would be fine there. And then same with the uh, back edge. I put a fillet here, rounded that out. And then I put a chamfer all on that side, and I need to do the same to this side. So I'm going to see if I can actually that face too. There we go. Um, okay, it's coming along. It looks like I'll need to scallop out this grill, uh, put in these lights uh, here at the front. I can actually put in the, uh, this edge here uh, as well. Uh, I want to make one of these wheels. So I'm going to show you how to make the wheel, the canopy, the spoilers, and then the three spoilers. We'll try and get all that done this week. Okay, so um, this has a, actually a, a actual assembly in it. And what we'll do is we'll model those as separate parts. And we'll assemble them here in this assembly. So the next thing I could create would be, say, the canopy and... Um, I could probably create that similar to the way I just created the body of the car and I would probably come up here again and uh, extrude a sketch. One nice th feature in Onshape is you can make uh, planes to make new sketches on. So here and one of the options in there is to do a midpoint plane so I could select this side and this side and it will put a midpoint plane in there I say yes and then I can select that plane and sketch on it because I'm going to put in using the spline tool this time I'm going to put in that basic uh, shape so a profile view of this car would be nice and here's one so you can see they get that kind of shape that I'm trying to get in there. Oops. 